Welcome to the Thursday Night Football Preview Show on CBS Local Sports. And welcome back to the NFL Today in the Thursday Night Preview. Week 11 in the league starts with Thursday Night Football only on NFL Network. It'll feature an AFC South Division matchup between the Titans and the Jags. You know, for me, it's about young quarterbacks to see how they grow. And so far, Marcus Mariota and Blake Bortles seem to be on the right track. Bortles has two outstanding wide receivers in Hearns and Robinson. I believe even though that they have a losing record, they believe in their minds that they have a chance at winning the AFC South. I look for big numbers from Blake Bortles in this game. I do, too, as well. You mentioned the two weapons that he has, but you forgot that you left out T.J. Yeldon. You forgot out Julius Thomas also. This guy is loaded. He, he's surrounded with good young weapons, guys that can make plays happen after the play, if they, if, after the catch, I'm sorry. And if they can really just shore up that defense just a little bit, I think this team can go really far. And yeah, they do. I mean, again, we talked about the AFC South. It's wide open for anybody. And I think, again, for Marcus Mariotti, it's continued to make growth and can they make progress right there. And Mike Malarkey took over two weeks ago. They're one and one right now. And it's a divisional game. And again, when you look at this division, if you can get on a streak of the two or three games, you can get yourself back into it. Because remember, Andrew Luck is out for an extended period of time in Indianapolis where they've owned this division. But now it's going to be under Hasselbeck. So that kind of has opened up, I think, the hopes for a lot of people. But again, you look at Jacksonville, big win last week and they get to go back home on a short week. Um, they, they're sitting in a pretty good position, I think. Yeah, they are, Coach. And I'll tell you what, you talk about the Indianapolis Colts. Now they, they have to go to the Atlanta Falcons and yeah. play a game with a backup quarterback. We know he has come in and played pretty well. But if they lose that game, which I think they will, all of a sudden, if Jacksonville goes out there and wins this game, they're, in, they're tied for first place. Game so it's going to be something that's going to be <laughs> very, very good to watch right now. Blake Boyles, him coming around. Rikers Mariota, too. Mike Malarkey taking over, just like yeah. you said. One sack in the last two weeks. Before that, he was getting sacked every eight times he dropped back to throw a, uh, yeah. a pass. So right now, both these teams are looking pretty good. Love the NFL down the stretch because the drama is still there. All right, be sure to catch us at noon Eastern every Sunday right here on the NFL Today.